Hi guys, welcome to my channel Czech Football, Barcelona, Paris Saint-Germain, Champions League, Game of Thrones. That was all back in May, a mere reminder, a relic of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps for one of these. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. So here it is, what we've all been waiting for. Make sure you are strapped in and ready to go. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. So off we go then. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Marquinhos. He's one of the toughest and most competitive centre-backs in the business. He's the kind of player you can rely on to always be just where you need... It's Griezmann! Griezmann really used his body to clever effect in dropping the shoulder to carry on. Ricky Pooch. Goes direct to the front line. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Marco Verratti. Rafinha. Paredes. Paredes drives it forward. It's being played forward. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Here it is now, surely! Going for goal! <laughs> Defending of the desperate variety. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Griezmann absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Barcelona are working the ball as only they can. Yeah, Peter, and it's a style that requires players of high-caliber technique to move the ball about quickly in tight areas. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Can he deliver? It's found its way to him. Goes for goal! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! The breakthrough strike! Oh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. Barcelona trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Pjanic. Receives it in a good position. 
Finds himself eased off the ball. Mbappe pushes to get on the end of it. This is promising. Mbappe. Forward it goes. Griezmann. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Mbappe. Gets good distance on it. And he just whacks it away. And it's Ferrati. Hits one! A potential goal of the season contender, if only. Oh, after so much hard work, he, he bluffed. He just shouldn't be missing from there. It is quite a run he's making here. So who's he picking out? Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Has a pop! It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. Barcelona really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. And it's played forward. Lorenzi goes looking. Is it out of harm's way? That's not going to make it. Neymar. It's a great ball. Ricky Pooch. And helps available out wide. Gets the better of his man. Great challenge, time to perfection. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Done very well to intervene. Neymar. Oh, good interception. And it's Messi. Ricky Pooch. Looks to clip it forward. Oh, the less said about that pass, the better. Tries to get it forward quickly. Mbappe. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Mbappe! Mbappe unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. He's away! It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Hoists it forward. Just brushed off the ball there. Rafinha. And it's Neymar. Look. And the half-time whistle goes. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Paris Saint-Germain head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. So we're just settling back into this second half. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. 
They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Now it's Smith. Has a pop! Rafinha. Oh, he's made sure that that won't get through. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Barcelona have a free kick. Oh, that is a bit special. That has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. Forward it goes. Longley goes back to base. Acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. And they've been caught out here. It's Neymar! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Good effort. Very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. PK. And it's played forward. The better of his opposite number. Griezmann. Griezmann crosses. Neymar looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, and defensively, there are a lot. Neymar! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. Cleared away. Florenti goes looking. Messi, a scorer already in the game. Barcelona ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. Messi. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Gets wrestled off the ball. That's a throw. Griezmann crosses. And Pjanic! Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. Tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his... And the shot! Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Mbappe. PK gets it back. Longley. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Well, that's where he wants it. Now it's Neymar. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Good idea, just poorly executed. And it's Griezmann. Griezmann plays it out to the wing. Hit into the middle. Rafinha. Hoists it forward. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Mbappe! Goal! Paris Saint 
Saint-Germain into the lead once more. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. And it's played forward. Barcelona are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Keeper's got good distance on that. Griezmann. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Shapes to shoot! Oh, should have been the equaliser. Griezmann. Paris Saint-Germain can make their change now with uh, a break in play. And it's Griezmann. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Nicely measured pass. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Can it battles to win it back? It is just a question of running down the clock now. And there's a long ball. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. And it needs to be any time now, really. Yeah, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. With the time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box. And if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Herrera. Longley goes looking. Forward it goes. And he's on his way! Jordi Alba with a delicate ball. Content. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Pretty much the ideal start. A win on the first day and a platform on which to build. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? 